Hello and welcome. Today we're going to solve simultaneous equations involving a quadratic equation. And to solve this, let's label the equations. Let's have this as our first equation or equation 1 and this will be equation 2. Now, from equation 1, we can make y the subject. If we add y to both sides of the equation, we're going to have 2x. We take y to the other side, is going to be y. And subtract 3 from both sides, we're going to have 2x minus 3. So y will be 2x minus 3. And we're going to use this in our second equation and substitute the value of y. So that x squared minus x times y, whereby our y is 2x minus 3 will be equal to minus 4. Then we remove brackets to get x squared minus x times 2x is 2x squared minus x times minus 3 is plus 3x, all right? Then add 4 to both sides of the equation. To remove negative 4 from this side, we're going to have plus 4 is equal to 0. Then we collect like terms together. x squared minus 2x squared is minus x squared plus 3x plus 4 is equal to 0. To remove the minus here, where we have minus x squared, let us divide each term by negative 1 and see what happens. We're going to have x squared minus 3x minus 4 is equal to 0. And that becomes our quadratic equation that we need to solve using a suitable method. We can use the method of factorization. So we need to find two numbers whose sum is minus 3 and product is minus 4. And those two numbers are negative 4 and 1. All right? So we're going to use those two, num those two numbers whose sum is minus 3 and product is minus 4. So we substitute minus 3x with the two numbers here in the equation and have x squared, right, plus 1x, or rather x, okay, minus 4x minus 4 is equal to 0. You realize that x minus 4x is minus 3x now. Then we can factorize by grouping. Let's go ahead and factorize by grouping. So we have x squared plus x, where we find that x is common, all right? Open brackets, x plus 1, close brackets, minus 4x minus 4, whereby minus 4 is common. So minus 4, open brackets, x plus 1 is equal to 0, okay? x plus 1 is common, x plus 1 is common, in brackets, open brackets again, x minus 4 is equal to 0. With that, we can find the value of x, so x plus 1 is equal to 0, which gives us the value of x is minus 1. Or x minus 4 is equal to 0. And that gives us the value of x is 4. So we have two values of x which are minus 1 and 4. We need to find the values of y. And from our subject y of the formula here, y is equal to 2x minus 3. So y is 2x minus 3. So when x is negative 1, when x is negative 1, y will be equal to 
times negative 1, right, minus 3. And that gives us minus 2, minus 3, which is minus 5. That is when x is minus 1. Alright? So when x is minus 1, y is minus 5. What about when x is 4? What will be the value of y? y will be equal to 2 times 4 minus 3. And that gives us 8 minus 3, which is 5. And those are the solutions to the simultaneous equations.